For our quarter one project's first week, I'm going to be doing scatter feeding. Scatter feeding is great because I love how the, the hamster has to hunt for food and they also can like explore their habitat, find places they want to hide and stuff, and store their food. I think that scatter feeding is great because you can hide food put in places high and low so they have to scourge for it all over. They also have to have fun while doing it, otherwise it's not really good. My hamster really liked it because he came out multiple times when he did scatter when we did scatter feeding. I think that doing scatter feeding will be a great long-term source, but I still do only still have to try out bowl feeding and doing a little hamster chew. For this week of the project, I did bowl feeding. Put it using his food bowl right there. I would put food in it, such as seeds, pellets, and flowers. I do not like bowl feeding as they don't have to hunt for it, so I probably will not use bowl feeding for a long-term source. The, I do like bowl feeding is because I can give him all the stuff he needs in one sp place, because if he cannot reach a spot, then he cannot get the food up there, meaning that he can get all his food in just one spot, but he's not hunting for it, which is why I do not like for it. For our final week of the project, I'm going to be doing a hamster chew. I have made a chew where he has to chew through to get his food. This is what I made. I put hamster straw in here, which he will not eat. So he, he has to chew through this part to get. I have hidden a nut in here and also some fresh food. I will be putting new food in here every day and recording how, it, how well he, he chews through it. I'm going to put it in here and most likely see how this works. And if it works very well, I will definitely use it more often than I have because as you can see in this cage I don't have very many chews as I mostly have hides and like a chew here but I cannot hide food in it so having a chew where he, it, there's food in it would be a great source for my hamster to have fun and also get food I will prob I will most likely be recording this every day and I will have a table or film of me having the results for the final project I did a uh, chew. I don't like, well, I mean, I like the chew, but I do not like the mess it makes. The mess is completely of the straw, but he did chew it and did come out multiple times. I got a video of him using it, and I will have this put in here. And I do like how it worked, but I still think that scatter feeding was the best choice. I will probably use scatter feeding for the rest of the time, because because I like how he can do everything and get all the food and stuff he needs while hunting. It was very good that he could do that and have fun while he hunts, which is the point of this project. I do also like the chew, but I do not like the mess it makes and having to clean that up, which also he cannot like, you know, come out while I'm cleaning because it might be like 12 o'clock or something, and it'll come out and then I'm doing that and I'll scare him away.